Iris, the world leader in electrical maintenance safety devices, is pleased to present ultrasound routes with eSentry Connect. eSentry Connect is an intelligent asset tagging system that utilizes near field communication or NFC to help you create and monitor condition based maintenance routes on your critical infrastructure assets. Any type of CBM route can be controlled using eCentry Connect to allow automated data collection, track asset health history, export reports to other CMMS platforms, and help you comply with the ISO 55000 asset management standard. So how does it work exactly? By purchasing some eCentry tags and an eCentry cloud subscription, you can begin a cost-effective route management program for all your CBM activities. Begin by logging into the secure eCentry Cloud system with your email and password. Only authorized users you have created can access your system. Once you've logged in, start creating the route by choosing equipment assets for which you have previously affixed and configured eCentry Connect tags. You can choose as many assets as you like to add to a route. Today we're creating an electrical asset ultrasound inspection route, but we could be doing infrared, vibration, visual inspection, valve testing, or really any kind of CBM task using the same tags. In fact, multiple data types can be recorded onto the same tag for any given asset, giving you the ultimate and flexible solutions for field CBM data collection. Once the route has been created and saved, it can be used repeatedly in the future. For now, we'll assign our electrical ultrasound route to one of our technicians. He will get a notification email, and when he logs into eSentry app on his smartphone or tablet, he will see the list of assets he needs to go and inspect. Route creation is done, and it's time to head out into the plant. Our technician finds the first asset he was assigned to inspect, panel H1 in the manufacturing primary electrical room. With the app, he can pair new tags to the system for the first time, add inspection instructions for future reference, view those instructions, view the prior inspection details and notes, and read write new data to the tag. Using the Sonus XT handheld ultrasound tester, he begins the inspection by opening panel H1's door and scanning and listening for any unusual ultrasound emanating from the enclosure. To begin recording data to the tag, he taps it to read current data on the tag into the eCentry Connect app. Here he sees when and by whom the previous inspection was performed, along with the data they recorded. He records his findings and notes into the app and writes that information to the tag with a few finger taps and by touching the screen again. The process is repeated on the next asset listed on our technician's route. Open the panel, scan for abnormalities, record new data to the eCentry Connect tag. Today we're recording ultrasound data and finding zero decibels, which is what we would expect. But next time we might be doing an infrared inspection and we would be recording data in degrees Celsius or Fahrenheit for trending. Again, the same tag can be used for recording multiple data types on this particular asset. Next, our, our technician moves to a dry type transformer. He scans around the ventilation opening for any ultrasound noise which would indicate arcing or tracking inside the transformer. Everything seems okay and he records his findings on the eCentry Connect tag. Had he found anything unusual, he could record a sound file using the Sonus XT and the Sonus View app on his smartphone, the same one that he's running the NFC app on, but more on that later. Last panel on our inspector's assigned route. Once he finishes this final asset inspection, he'll be able to mark the route as completed. Only by interacting with each and every tag on the route that he was assigned and recording new data to those tags is he able to close out this inspection route. As the maintenance planner scheduler, you can see the status of all the open routes that you have assigned to your staff via the eCentry Connect cloud system. Back at his desk, the technician opens the Sonus View Pro Analyzer software to look at an unusual sound waveform he recorded earlier in the week using that Sonus View app and his Sonus XT handheld. He can look at the sound in the frequency domain and the time domain or even using a 3D spectrogram. In this way, he can compare it to known examples of arcing, tracking, or corona and make a determination of what type of problem he might be seeing. Coming back to the eCentry cloud, we can look at the inspection details of any asset, including those our technician just inspected. Any notes taken are permanently recorded here as part of the asset's life history. 
Color coding makes it easy to see any assets been placed into an alarm condition for any reason. We can view histograms of the inspection values of any asset. A drop-down lets us choose from different data sets. For instance, ultrasounds in decibels, vibration in millimeters per second, torque in foot-pounds or newton meters, or temperature in Celsius or Fahrenheit. Custom reports can be created by choosing the data range and a data subset and then exporting this to a CSV file for further manipulation and analysis. It is also possible to port data from the eCentric Connect cloud system into a CMMS platform like Maximo or SAP. eCentric Connect is an excellent way to collect your ultrasound or other condition-based maintenance inspection data efficiently and with minimal effort. It makes it easy to manage your users, create and manage inspection routes, see asset health trends, and generate custom reports. For more information on ultrasound hardware and software solutions and eCentric Connect Intelligent Asset Tags, please visit www.iris.com.